Hey guys, Magenta is back here today again and I'll be bringing to you another super awesome Legion deck profile of my uh, Tachikaze uh, Ancient Dragon deck yeah, featuring Legion so yeah, so this is one of the two crit gains deck that I'll be doing so the second will be Jewel Knight, so basically that's all of the yeah, basically I said that I'll be doing uh, two crit gain legion decks. Yeah. So no one got it, correct? It's a pity. Okay, whatever. So without further ado... Oh damn! Yep, so I uh, kind of forgot the arranged deck. Okay, but now it's settled. Let's start with the start starter. So starter. <clears throat> uh, color blast one. When this unit is put from rear guard into drop zone, uh, and your vanguard is in legion, uh, search your deck for a unit on your vanguard circle and call it to rear guard. So synergizes very well in the in this deck's two boss monsters. Yeah, I'll show you. So basically, uh, this decks this deck has two different play styles depending on your situation yeah so let's get on the crit trees so of course the main main boss monster of the deck would be ancient dragon tyranno quake so legion 20,000 with uh, ancient dragon tyranno bite yeah give me a moment tyranno bite yeah from legion so his skill, uh, during your battle phase when a uh, unit on your vanguard circle is being retired uh, and this unit is in legion, it gets plus 5k1 crit. Yeah, so you just have to retire and it gets 5k1 crit. So his second skill, when this unit attacks, you may retire one unit. If you do this, get, this card gets plus 5k. Yeah, so basically you can combo the second skill with the first skill. So it will be a uh, 30, 30k 2 crits attack. Yeah, with no boost. So it's pretty good. Okay, so the next boss monster of the deck uh, Ancient Dragon, 4 copies. Ancient Dragon Magma Armor. So Legion with uh, Ancient Dragon Knight Armor. Pardon me if I get the names wrong. Okay, so uh Colonel Blast 1, Soul Blast 1, when when a uh, rear guard is retired by effects of your cards and this unit is in Legion, Colonel, you may pay cost if you do, call that card to a rear guard circle. So next when this unit attacks and you have another unit in the center column, it gets plus 3k. Yeah, so I'll demonstrate the combos pretty soon. Okay, so 4 copies of Tyranno Bite. So basically, when this unit is retired, you may pay the cost. You may you may pay the cost if you do uh, call this card back to a rear guard circle. And uh, you must have an Ancient Dragon Vanguard. So basically, you just at a cost of Counter Blast 1, you can activate the other card skill. Okay, so next, 4 copies. Uh, knight armor. So retire one of your uh, ancient dragons. So when this unit attacks and your vanguard is in legion, you may pay cost. If you do, this card gets plus five k power and the skill. When this unit attack hits a vanguard, you may unflip one one damage. Yeah. So basically, it's an unflipper, and it's a fourteen k attacker. So the extra five k hits magic numbers like uh. So 9k with 7k boost and 16k with extra 5k it will force a 15k shield it's pretty good so and we play the early early version of that card so this card is from bt11 so your, your vanguard doesn't have to be in legion and yeah that's it so when this unit attacks uh, retire one ancient dragon and plus 5k power not too bad. Okay, so grid ones, two quintet walls, 
for the early filling of the the uh, legion. Yeah. So two uh, perfect guards, Hera's wall. Okay. So two uh, this uh, unflipper. So basically, it's a battle sister lemonade clone. So when this unit is placed on rear guard circle, so blast two and I flip two points of damage. It's really good. Okay, so play three 10k attackers. Yeah, because 10k attackers are awesome. I like. And lastly, four of this Iguano God. So it's also a very early uh, ancient dragon. So basically, uh, what this does is it's the same as Tyrano Bite. When this unit is retired, you may pay the cost if you do call it back to a regular circle. Yeah. So, yeah, it's basically a very. It's a key card in every Ancient Dragon deck. So that's all for everything. Uh, triggers, standard, uh, 8 crits. Uh, this crit uh, is the Red Lightning clone. Move it into your soul and inflict 1 damage. Yeah, this is just vanilla triggers. It crits. Four draws. And four heals. Okay, so now I will demonstrate uh one um, one uh heavy hitting playstyle and one uh multi attack playstyle. Yes, that's it. <clears throat> Hold on. So basically, uh, the heavy hitting, the heavy hitting play style will be based on Tyranno Quick, while the multi attack play style will be based on Magma Armor. In case you haven't realized. Okay, so basically the combo is, uh, so you attack with one side of the rear guard with your Tyranno Bite, so that's your first 16k attack, yeah, and you use your Vanguard Swing for 30, 35k 2 crits, and retire by retiring one of yourself, and you call it back, the call of Counter Blast 1. So you check world trigger, then you can just pump into the rear guard. And lastly you can attack with your rear guard again and use this last column to attack. And you can retire for extra 5k power. Yeah, basically that's just nothing much. It's just five attacks. At the cost of two counter blasts. So if you want consistency, you do not wish to be doing this too often. Yeah? Okay, so yeah, hold on while I set up the multi attack. By multi attack, I mean like really, really a lot of attacks. Like, uh, if you want to final turn someone, yeah, you can use this this combo. Okay, I always have my starter there. Cause yeah, I always draw the. Vanguard cards. Okay, so basically, uh, we run like uh those strong monsters with those monsters with uh with the retire one plus five k. Because uh, when they are retired, they just retired. However, our Vanguard's Legion skill allow them to be revived. So let's say you have. 5 damage Okay, you have 5 damage, 5 points of flip <clears throat> 5 points of damage And let's just say uh, You legion once So maybe your soul is what, 4 cards Okay, that's legit, right Okay So basically uh, You attack with your vanguard first So if you check any triggers, you pump it to the rear guards behind or whatever just pump it to any rear guard so attack with any random column okay so you can you retire the one behind uh, on the other side 
So you retire, retire him, and you call him back with the Vanguard skill. That's both the first counter blast, and that's two attacks down. So you can repeat it again. Call him, and again and again until you run out of counter blast. So it will be, or you run out of soul blast. So there will be additional four attacks. Yeah, it's pretty darn strong if you ask me. Yeah. So yeah, I would. Huh. Uh, my math skills told me it will be around like uh seven attacks. Yeah. Hold on, just let me count a bit. So three attacks. You retire him. Much. Yeah, seven. Seven attacks. So. Seven decent attacks. I mean. Yeah, you get a 5k from retiring and stuff like that. And granted that your opponent doesn't play like OTT and just wreck you. Just wrecks you with the overwhelming hand size. Yeah, that's it. So, it's a very flexible deck. You can play it in two ways. Yeah. Play in two ways. You either you crit your opponent death early. Or late game you hit him so many times he won't remember what hit him. Yeah, basically that's it. So hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, leave a like down below to show me some support. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe if you like to see more uh, deck profiles, card reviews, and product openings of Vanguard and Bodyfight. So until the next video, peace out. Bye!